Okay guys, it's me Imad. So today in this video tutorial we will learn about how to make a piano circuit with the help of Arduino Uno. The compiler which we are using is the VOCV online compiler. So here in Google we will write VOCV. And here we need to click on VOCV.com. And it will lead us to this page. Here are here we can see four of our microcontrollers. That is STM32, Pi Pico, ESP32 and Arduino Uno. And we, we need to click on Arduino. And here we will search for our window. And here it's the circuit window of Arduino Uno. So click on that. Here we have two windows. One is the programming window and the window on the right hand side is actually the circuit window. So now we will press control and minus sign so that our microcontroller will become small. Now we need to take push buttons. So we need to take around six push buttons. So we will write here and this button. So one and two and then third. And then fourth one, and then so one, two, three, four, five, and we need to, and this is sixth one. So now these are our six push buttons. Now we need to connect one side or one pin of the push buttons with each other so that we can connect them with the common ground okay so like this And now this okay so like this we, we will connect our first push button with that of pin number four the next one with the pin number five and Next one with the pin number six. And then with pin number seven. And then with pin number eight. And then with pin number nine. And we will take one more push button. Okay, and connect it with the we will connect it with the pin number 10. Okay, and we also need to connect this with the other button so that one pin of the buttons are now connected with each other, means that it is a common pin. We also need to connect the ground with these pens, okay? Like uh, this. And here we will take one line wire like this and we will connect ground with this like this. We also need to take the buzzer. So this is our buzzer. We need to connect it with the pin number 11. Like this. Okay. And. And ground with this like this. Okay. So this is our circuit diagram. 
now we need to move towards our circuit so first we need to declare some variables with some values in these so here we write hdefine hdefine t underscore c 262 hdefine t underscore d 294 hdefine t underscore e 330 and hdefine t underscore f 343 and hdefine okay it's uh 330 and it's 349 okay not three it's 349 hash t underscore g it is 392 now one more thing that these are actually the value of tone the just like the frequency of each tone or pitch of the tone a defined t underscore a sorry t underscore a 440 h defined t underscore b 493 okay now we will write const and buzz our buzzer is equal to pin number 11 so wherever we will write buzzer it means pin number 11 so in white setup one more thing that uh, we need to write certain certain pin modes like pin mode 4 comma output okay okay we can declare it as output no not not output input input is okay 4 comma input control c and uh, like paste it for six times or like this and we will declare 5 comma input 6 comma input 7 8 and 9 and 10 comma input we also need to write pin mode 11 comma output because our buzzer has been connected with this pin so it is output our buzzer has been connected to pin number 11 so it is the output so now we will go towards while loop here we write if digital read although we have declared okay we have declared all the pins as input so we can write digital read on all these pins if digital read of 4 is equal to is equal to 0 means that whenever we will press the push button it will connect the corresponding pin with the ground and it is logic 0 on the respective pin so if digital read of 4 is equal to is equal to 0 then the following condition will get executed what is that tone function tone function it is actually first uh, tone is a built-in function it will generate a specific sound or tone for us so it, it first you you have to give the uh, pin number on which buzzer has been connected and then we will write t underscore c means that tone value and here we will write delay of 50 okay and here we will write no tone no tone of buzzer means that all the tone must be uh, must be stopped so now we will run it out okay it, it is it is it is reading co continuously okay it is reading continuously zero okay why, why it is so because okay we also need to make these high okay in 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 what setup we also need to write digital write four comma high okay because our logic is for on zero at first we we need to make these pins high eight 
9 and 10. So this is the thing. So now we will run it out. Now you can see as soon as we will press the push button our our corresponding note has been played and uh, now we will just write this just copy this if chunk and paste it here so digital read of 4 is equal to 0 digital read of 5 t comma d if digital read of 6 t comma e and then here control v if digital read of 4 5 6 and then 7 so it is d e f g a b okay so d e f d e and here we will write f g okay and it must be 8 pin for 8 pin it is like that and for 9 pin so digital read is just checking that either it is 0 on pin if it is that it will just generate a respective tone for us T G T A and for 10 T comma B now I will run it out press the first button okay now this so these are our seven notes of piano so hopefully you got the concept that how you can make a piano circuit with that of Arduino Uno inside Wokvi online simulator so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe.